Hello everybody, and welcome back to Pokemon Gold Part 2. My name is John the Knight. Sorry, I had to think about that because I actually was playing this for a little bit on my own. And it wasn't much progress. I was actually recording it and something messed up and then, you know, whatever. So there might be one video today, there might be two. I'm going to be at this all night just recording videos non-stop for you guys. Anyway. I got my Totodile at level 11, I captured a Caterpie, and I leveled it up at once, I think, yep. And if you might notice, the graphics may look a little different. And that's because I was able to enhance the bits or whatever. I already faced two trainers, I'm very sorry. I recorded it, it got all messed up, and I'm very sorry. But it's whatever, it just happened. Hey look, a Metaplod. Do I want to tackle to death? No, the answer is no. It's too much of a time waster for Nava King. For a level 5 Caterpie at least. If, for my Toter Dial, he'll be, eh, he'll be alright. Caterpie! Sorry, I'm just... I heard noises, I'm just like, what the fuck is that? Oh, come on. I don't want to do the speedy upper thingy unless I absolutely have to. Because I could always go back and just edit it out so you guys won't have to hear it. That's probably what I'm going to do. If I see a battle that goes on for way too long, I'm just going to edit it out. Alright, let's get going. I faced the bug catcher. Yes, I this now this is the part where I left off. I went back to go to the Poke Stop. No, I thought that Poke Stop. The Pokemon Center. Rejuvenate Re Pokemon came back and this is the part where I, where I left off. Ooh, a bell sprout. Oh my god, it looks so horrifying. Everything looks horrifying. I might try to capture it. For a particular reason. If grass does not affect Caterpie good soon. Oh, do I really want an Onyx? Do I really want an Onyx? The answer to that is maybe. Don't be crit! Okay. Whoop! 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 I dang it. A tackle! A tackle! Alright. Even though Butterfly's gonna be virtually useless for me, I still want her. Want I forgot what's all in gold, like Pokemon wise. It's a fruit fairy tree. Hey, it's a bitter fairy. It cures confusion, I think. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, but da! Bum bum bum! Ba 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 da! God, I, I just love, like, like, bit music like that. I like bit music and I like orchestral music a lot. Your level two canopy will die! Well, fake because Pokemon don't die in Pokemon Battle! We gotta win this battle. I've always wanted to do a random Nuzlocke, like actual random, random Nuzlocke uh, Pokemon game. I think Caterpie evolves at level seven.
Tackle! A tackle! A tackle! Wait, do I have a third ability? I'll check. Boop. Come on, Canopy! Tackle your way to victory! A Weedle? We don't even. It's not even in this game. Oh my god, it looks so horrifying. I think maybe I'm gonna switch back to the other one. Fight. Pokemon. Oh, uh, okay. I, I was wondering, like, what was I stopping to think about? It was the. I don't have a third ability on Strategy. Which is really. It's not that surprising. I didn't think Caterpie would have a third ability at all. Gotta tackle my way to victory! Got to attack, oh no, Caterpie is poison now, you must tackle it, then I tackle it, then he will die, he does a poisonous turn because that's how it works. <laughs> God, I love, I love doing that, I'm sorry. Uh, let's see how it goes. Let's just see how it goes. It's only level 2. I think I killed him. Nope, I didn't, not yet. I didn't kill him yet. Good amount of damage. Yep. Okay, so, so it's 3 damage, so I can so only survive one more turn. And I got an antidote, but I don't know if I can. Because I don't like my Caterpie that much. <laughs> also, we're close to a Pokemon. Pokemon setting. Alright, so it's three per turn, so I got three more tackles in me. Even that was a critical hit. That one HP was a critical hit. I think we got this in the bag. So two and then one. Okay. And he goes first for some reason. And I missed. That's not good. Does this kill him? Okay, you're good. Caterpie. My Caterpie solo beat you, bitch! Pokemon got your way, was defeated, John got 32 Poke Dollars for winning! Alright, what's this Pokeball right here? Oh! <laughs> Who guessed it? Even though all items are like Oh god, I forgot about this part. I forgot poison actually poisons. I don't wanna. Alright. I don't want to waste berries, because berries are harder to get, I believe. Bum 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 bum, Pidgey, you will die by not my Caterpie, my Caterpie will die. Tackle! So I want to crock it. <laughs> I think I said that in the, my previous recording. I'm like, Rawr! wait, dude, what do crocodiles sound like when they scratch? Rawr! Rawr! I found a good Pokemon in Dark Cave. I'm gonna raise it and take on Flakman. He's the leader of Violet's Gym's leader. Man, I wish I could get Golem, but I can't because I can't trade Pokemon like that in this game. I want to heal up my Pokemon and go to Bellsprout Tower, I think. Okay, heal my Pokemon, dude. I want my I want my Butterfree, because I like I like how butter sleep powder I think in this gen sleep powder is like really awesome. Like it's pr it's pretty damn good. I was gonna get an onyx, but I decided against it. Is Steelix in this game? I think he is. I don't know. No, I'm pretty sure he's not. Oh, ah! I don't, I don't, uh, I don't remember Pokemon very well. Okay, I, I don't need anything. I don't need anything. It's okay. Not right now. Well. It's not night time, I think. Can Book Cure tell me? It's 4.13pm. That's four hours behind 
So, <laughs> it's not exactly on. I'm gonna buy some Pokeballs. Yes, I want to buy one Pokeball, sir. Oh, God damn it. <laughs> I did it again. Okay, uh, 10 will do. Okay, that's all I need. I only need 10 Pokeballs. Thanks. Thanks for the energy. Alright. Now let's go to Billsburg Tower. Just right away. Let's just try and get this over with. I want to beat this game! Gen 2 has eluded me for too long! And I'm not gonna miss you. Come on, just battle me. However hard we battle, the tower will stand strong. Not if a ho-ho blows through it. <laughs> oh, that was horrible. What was it? Is that part of the lore? Did, did Ho-Ho destroy that tower over that town next to you? Attack! Oh! Caterpie will destroy you! He's a bug Pokemon, so he's not affected so easily against grass! Because bug Pokemon live in the grass, and that's how it works, and then the Pokemon... <laughs> God, I still think it, the pixels are kind of horrifying. I think I'm probably going to switch back to my other emulator. This emulator was supposed to enhance pixels or something. And it looks kind of cool, but at the same time, like, when I see their, their eyes, they look so, like... Ugh. Like, look at the Pokeball texture. It looks so nice in the, in the words and everything, but then when you get to the sprites, that's when it's horrible. Summon another Bill Sprout. Well, I respond by tackling you. Magic flying go. I'm gonna tap my Caterpie. I remember, like, the transition to Yu Gi Oh! and Magic was so hard. I was, like, playing Yu Gi Oh! and I'm like, I attack, but you don't, you don't, like, flip or anything. And, like, when, when I first got, started playing Magic, like, when I had my own cards, when I said I wanted to block, I would tap my creature to block. And it was like one of the most common new mistakes you could make. I, I love it. I love it. Oh my god, you got another bell sprout? No, I don't want to switch. Not yet. There's a chance Caterpie can do this all on his own. I believe in you, Caterpie. You're my real starter. True Pokemon trainers start with Caterpie. Cause he evolves faster. Although evolving faster does that mean he's stronger. I just like Caterpie. I would prefer Caterpie as my starter over Totodile. No offense to Totodile. Totodile is a million times stronger than Butterfree. I mean, not Butterfree, but Caterpie... Like, pure stat-wise, to Totodile will definitely wreck Caterpie. No problem. I just like Caterpie better. What? Caterpie's evolving? You can't do that! No! Stop! B! 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 <laughs> and it's a shiny metapod. <laughs> Alright, now I need to go back. You learn hard and... And we're back! I forgot, almost forgot to say that. This is the part where we left off. I wanted to make sure my Pokemon were actually healed. Oh, I can't go anywhere. I must have to go directly in your face. Come in upon you look so freaky. Why are your eyes behind your head? I don't know, it looks bad again. Fight with me, all you want is gonna deal only one damage or two. I it wasn't paying attention, to the tackle, metapod, metapod, you missed, oh my god. Uh. Tackle? You see, Harden, I like Harden for one particular reason. Because. <laughs> If I would have used it at the beginning of the fight, just straight up hardened, I would probably would have lost a lot less health. 
is fine with me. Is physical and... There's physical and there's like... Power, I think. No. In this game. Like there's... Like there's... Things are affected by attack, things are affected by special attack. I, I forgot if Binding Whip was special attack or not. So I'm not sure if Harden would actually work against those parts of Binding Whip. Like I said, I'm not trying to look anything up, I'm just going straight for it. I just want to beat this game! I have been through this tower at least 10 times. No matter what. I think I'm, I think I might cut out most of this video until I can collect the top, because these trainers are actually really easy. And there's something that like really fuckery happens, I will probably post it. Metapod gained 54 XP, but the stage show was defeated. But the thank you, but the thank you. There is an item up here. It's a X defense. Da 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 da. Sway like leaves in the wind. <laughs> Bell sprouts for days. Tackle till you beat them all. <laughs> I think my voice sounds completely horrible if I um, go back and listen to this. You guys are probably like, ah, no, stop singing. Funnily enough, I took four years in the chorus. All four of them, in which the only reason I was there was because so I can be first in line for lunch. Because that was the school policy. Like if you, if you were in a musical, in the musical department, you have to go to practice, but you always get lunch first. And I always loved that. I loved how I can exit class early just to go to lunch earlier than everyone else. It was amazing. Yeah, you got one more hit in the uh, menopause. I believe in you. I believe that you can beat him in this tackle! You can do it, Metapod! Don't let your dreams be dreams! Oh! <laughs> you son of a bitch! Alright, you can't face another bell scrap. <laughs> um, no. I'm gonna click no, and then when the options come up, I'm gonna switch. Because now Metapod will get a level. Using that noggin. We well, won't get. Oh god! I completely forgot. But Totodile is too high level for you. That Totodile is three times more powerful than my Bell Sprout. It's almost four times. Scratch. Yep, Metapod leveled up. Do, 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 do. Oh, I'm so weak. I'm so weak. Alright, be right back. And we're back! If I cut the if I cut it to here. Who knows what I'll do. John found potion! Alright. This I might have to go back like multiple times, because I really want to get my mid pod leveled up. <laughs> He's really close to actually evolving the like, butterfree. It's a high level bell sprout. Go metapod. I want to test this out. This will test out if Vine Whip is physical, I think. Okay. That pretty much confirmed it for me. <laughs> Vine Whip is not physical, it's special. Oh, that's what it is physical and special. Oh, yeah. Okay. It's been a while since I've been in Pokemon lingo. Especially Gen 2 wise. Bum, 
person A. What do you mean you missed? You're literally just a metapod. You can just fling yourself at him. Fine with I got fine within the face. Oh no 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 no! I got fine within the face, but I got a hundred eight experience. Beaten by a child, impossible. Hey, the illusion of lights even the pitch is darkness. Alright, you you're at reduced at eight half your speed, but the only reason you got reduced to that much is because he did not do that <laughs> and, and because you missed an attack one. Is it still two? No, it's way more than two now. It is way more than two. Miss a vine whip. Okay, you got one more hit in you. 108 XP is really worth it for you, Metapod. It's not very effective. You know, blacking out here wouldn't be a bad idea. But I'm gonna go with the sissy route and get you a potion. It's not very effective. I wonder why. It's like bugs live in the grass or something. Especially metapods. They live in grass like not I know on other. No other. And BOOM! You're dead, Bill Sprout. Or faint and we're back! Time to face this dude. Let me see how much you trust your Pokemon. I don't trust my Pedipod and I bet I better trust my mid I don't trust my Metapod! to tackle anything. It still happens to do it, though. Ooh, you're level 7. That means you're gonna give even more XP! <laughs> Shit, I don't have a potion. And my tackle might be with dicks. Oh god. This is not looking good for poor Metapod. You got an extra 10 HP in the... Uh... Oh, somehow, I don't get how these, this this first turn based thing is. I mean, if I go first, I'll probably win. But if he's going first because he's faster, which means I'm going to lose. And we're going to do this kind of battle. How much damage does it do? Three. Okay. So you've got at least three more hits in here. Unless he crits, then you're fucked. Boom. One more, one more tackle, and you got this. Come on, tackle. Boom. Bell Sprout is destroyed by a Metapod. All right, Metapods almost. Oh god. Yes, I have to. No, no, not yet, not yet, not yet. Now I switch. <laughs> God, I hurt my voice. Scratch! Scratch! Come on, Totodile. You can do it. Your obvious superiority is letting you able to win. Oh no! The foresight! Good thing he identified you as a Totodile that turn. <laughs> I, I was always confused with that ability. I'm like, who has identified your Pokemon? I'm like, yeah, it's a Totodile. I could have told you that. I mean, you didn't have to waste a turn. What? That was level 11. Alright, I got a Butterfree, guys. Got a Butterfree! Butterfree! Confusion. All right, 
this is gonna be the last time I cut out because I'm running out of time for the episode, so be right back! And we're back. We're definitely back. I was just, it took me a while to get, because I accidentally was not paying attention where I was going. You are indeed skilled as a trainer. As promised, here is your HM. But let me say this. You should treat your Pokemon better. The way you battle is far too harsh. Pokemon are not tools of war. Huh. He claims to be the elder, but he's weak. It stands to reason. I'd never lose to fools who babble about being nice to Pokemon. I only care about strong Pokemon that can win. I really couldn't care less about weak Pokemon. Viewers, you use escape rope, damn you! I forgot how to name them that. And here's my escape rope. Right. Place myself right there. So good of you to come here. Sprout Tower is a place of training. People in Pokemon test their bonds to build a bright future together. I am the final test. Allow me to check the ties between your Pokemon and you. Butter free! There's confusion! I think this is like the earliest psychic attack you can get. Oh! It's super effective! I, psychic is super effective against grass? I, I thought. Is it really? That changes my like my whole perspective right now. I thought they were weak to poison. Uh oh, hoo hoo. As long as you don't have to pack your fire. Confusion. And then pack! Oh, he identified my Pokemon is indeed a Butterfree. I'll, I'll give you that. I'll let you have that one. I think I know what it actually does, I just can't remember. Isn't it like, if it identifies, like you can now use normal attacks against ghost types or something like that? Okay, yeah, it doesn't have peck. I kind of guessed if it did have <laughs> I guessed if it didn't have peck. I honestly did not know. I was just hoping it did. <laughs> I was like, this is a pretty low level Pokemon. He probably doesn't have peck. And... I want to learn Sleep Powder now, right? Is this the part where I learn Sleep Powder? Nope. It's a little bit higher level. Bell Sprout. I wonder why you switched out so. See, like the the pixel, the enhanced pixels I got on this emulator. Butterfree looks amazing, but the Bell Sprout looks god awful. It looks like he has a blood tear coming out of his eye. All right, and boom! Ah, excellent. You and your Pokemon should have no problem using this move. Take this Flash HM. John received HM5! Flash illuminates even the darkest of all places, but to use it out of battle, you need the badge of Violet's Gym. And escape rope time. That's not escape rope time. Alright, that ends the episode here. So I've been. Uh, that ends the episode of Bill's Tower. I'll see you nights later. Bye!